up you guys it's your girl Rainique and I'm back with another video for you guys today so basically my camera is like tilted all over the place because my tripod is so unstable <sighs> but anyways I'm back with another video for you guys today I know I'm looking a bit rough but don't mind me it's Sunday and it's about like 12 o'clock going on one o'clock and I know I haven't filmed a video for you guys since I dropped my like Puerto Rico slash birthday vlog which was a while ago but like I mentioned I be having days where I just don't have any creativity in me I don't have any ideas for content to post for you guys and honestly I'm trying to like do more like vlogs and stuff like that because it's just more like within my timing schedule and what I could really put out there for you guys. Also, if you hear a TV in the background with little kid stuff, ignore it. It's my little sister's TV show going on. But yeah, so basically today's video is gonna be like a little bit of a spend the day with me uh, video. I don't have much to do, but I did do a Target haul. Um, I went to Target and got some like hygiene products and et cetera. And I was gonna go ahead and un like show all the stuff that I got to you guys. Cause like, here I go. This is my desk for my business, where I be handling my business stuff, so don't mind the mess. But yeah, I got a couple of bags here with stuff that I got from Target. So I get to show you guys that. And then I'm going to go ahead and put most of those away in my bathroom. And then I also have to clean my car out today because it looks a hot mess, a hot, hot mess, okay? And then I also did get an order on my website, so I might pack an order in this video. I don't know. It depends on how long. The video is by the time I'm finished cleaning my car and stuff like that but that's pretty much all I have to do today um I would have taken you guys along with me earlier when I went to go get food and stuff but yeah it was too late by the time I thought about it but um yeah but if you guys are into any before I get into my video if you guys are into any skincare body care or anything like that definitely go shop my business my skincare line that brand skin in the link down below go ahead and shop our um body butters body scrubs body oils facial oils face bars like shop i'm out of breath y'all this is a lot shop all of that because i would greatly appreciate the support and yeah and i know you'll love it because i love it and a lot of people that buy it they love it as well so yeah but that's pretty much what this video is going to be about a little bit of spending the day with me and me watching me do my errands and stuff and my little mini target haul or whatever i wish i would have taken you guys with me to target but I'd be so awkward with vlogging in places like public places by myself when I'm by myself but yeah also something that I haven't put out there yet that you guys are the only ones to know so far whenever I drop this video and then I eventually once I print out the labels and stuff and make my body butters I'll definitely post it on my business Instagram but also we're having a sale coming up soon so definitely look out for that but i'm coming out with two new scents and i'm super excited because they smell my arms are tired so let me switch okay but yeah i'm coming out with two new scents and they smell bomb this one doesn't have a label on it it's also a sugar scrub my body scrub um it is coconut and it smells so 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 good you guys i know you guys are gonna like it because i love it <laughs> And then I'm also coming out with, um, this is also another body scrub. I haven't made the body butters yet, but this is also another body scrub. And this is actually, um, my mango passion fruit. And this smells so, so bomb. So yeah, I'm coming out with two new scents, fruity flavors, fruity scents or whatever. And they smell amazing, you guys. Like they smell really good. I love it. So I'm excited. <laughs> but yeah still in the work so i haven't dropped that yet but it should be coming out soon if not in march by the beginning of april and yeah so stay tuned for that but what was i gonna say i totally forgot what i was gonna say yeah i can't think of what i was gonna say if it comes back in my head then i'll say it but until then let's go ahead and get straight into this target haul so that i'm not just sitting here talking for the entire video oh don't forget to like comment and subscribe down below i mean not subscribe down below but subscribe to my channel because we are on the road to 200 subscribers and i know that you guys can get me there so yeah anyways but definitely comment down below what videos you want to see and stuff like that because i'd be wanting to like record more vlogs and stuff for you guys but like i don't be doing nothing and i feel like who just i don't want to just get on the camera and be boring or not be doing anything or have anything to show you guys i mean 
you know i want it to be like that's why i vlog every now and again i post every now and again because lately i just haven't been doing anything but i do have a couple video ideas that i want to do so i may be doing that um shortly but this next weekend i do have plans so i'll take you guys along with me to that my friend is having like a 90s 2000s theme game night type thing and we have to dress up and so i'll probably film like a get ready with me so you guys can see that part and i'll also just take you guys with me to the game night and record that for you guys as well so yeah let's go ahead and get straight into this video i'm out of breath and i don't know why every time i start recording on this camera i'll be getting out of breath talking to y'all like i be trying to like speed talk and fit everything in one video but anyways let's go ahead and get straight into this okay. so i'm back so let's go ahead and get this um little haul started so first things first i don't know a lot of females i don't know if you're like me or not but i i love candles i love candles and honestly i spent about 90 something dollars in target on most of the stuff and i didn't even get a lot but target you know target be expensive <laughs> but um yeah first to start it off i got a lot of like these little candles they were like four dollars in target and I got a lot of them because I love burning me a good candle, especially if it smells good. And it has like the little top and this is what it looks like. It's a little candle, something slight. But this one is um, Oasis Palm. And then I got this Mandarin Hibiscus. And I thought at first I thought it was going to be like super fruity. I'm trying. <laughs> at first I thought it was going to be like super fruity, but because I don't like citrusy, fruity smells like that. I mean, I like those smells that I'm coming out with my body butter, my body scrubs and body butter with. But like, I don't like citrusy smells like lemon, orange, stuff like that. But this smells really, really good. It smells really good. And I, I love the smell of coconut too. So that's what's in here as well. I got um, pineapple lemonade, y'all. Let me tell you, pineapple lemonade smells. It smells so bomb. I cannot wait. I have other candles that I need to burn and finish burning off before I can use these. But I'm addicted to candles. So. Had to get them. And then I got agave coconut. When I tell y'all, it smells so good. And they're so cute. Like the packaging and stuff is super cute. I like it. And then I also got sugared orchid. This one has more um in it than the other ones. If you notice, like, how low this one is compared to this one yeah it has more like the whatever you call it in it but this is actually probably my favorite one the sugared orchid let me put this up some more because i don't need to be bending down like that but yeah i'm trying to like give y'all a good view without it being too dark and my camera kind of tilted. Oh my gosh. Okay. Whatever. We're just going to work with that. But yeah, those are... I got six candles. Six of these little candles. Love them. I'll probably share some with my mom. That's one bag down. This is empty. And then I got some stuff for my bathroom. So I got like some soaps. Some hand soaps for my bathroom because you don't want to be you don't want to be soapless now if y'all ain't got no soap in your bathroom you're nasty but <laughs> let me stop i'm not judging you but still it's kind of gross and then i got some body washes um just trying out new stuff ignore my dad in the background because he is talking downstairs so just ignore that because he can be loud jamaican people they don't know how to keep it like keep the tone down they be talking so loud i swear they be tone deaf <laughs> But I got some body washes. Um, I wanted to try the Olay body washes. I don't know. Honestly, I feel like they're just aesthetically pleasing. And I was like, okay. I'm going to try it. <laughs> but I got this one. It was like a cleansing and brightening. And it has like vitamin C. I actually don't know what it smells like. Because I didn't open it in the store. It actually smells really good though. This I got this one. The cleansing and brightening. Olay body wash so I'm excited to start using that and then I also got this Olay um b3 complex body wash so it's like notes of orchid and black currant I this I did smell this I did smell in um target and it was it smelled really good that's why I got it 
<laughs> it smells really good so yeah i got these three and the only reason i'm trying to use like different body washes is because like i back i feel like i'd be buying like don't get me wrong the bath and body works body washes are cool and all but like i want a body wear a body wash that actually has like vitamins and stuff like that that's actually gonna nourish my skin when i use it you know what i'm saying like not just make me smell good but also nourish be like providing nutrients to my skin you know because yeah i use my own body butters that have like a lot of vitamins and stuff like that and i use my sugar scrubs but i feel like when you use a body wash that not only provides like really good like vitamins and stuff and hydrates your skin and stuff like that and it's better than regular soaps like that's not words because i mean like really what do they have other than just the scent and it'd be like the same price and you get bigger so i mean you just you just can't go wrong <laughs> but i'm actually trying to like take more care of my skin um, to be completely honest because I feel like I be kind of neglecting my skin sometimes like but now that I've started my skincare line and stuff and I've been using my body butters my body scrubs I feel like my skin has been getting so much better but then I feel like it's getting better but then I feel like I'm also damaging it by using whatever body washes I'm using because what exactly are they really bringing to my skin like what nutrients would help nothing so I'm glad I got these to like start trying out new body washes that actually have like you know some type of vitamins or like stuff that's good for your skin so i got that um i got this razor so i usually just get waxed in most areas but for my legs armpits stuff like that i do use my razor um, maybe I'll take you guys on a wax day with me. Maybe a wax vlog whenever I go back. My wax girl, she's really, really cool. Love her. She's lit. But I usually, this is the only ones that I use. This is a new, the new way that they put like the little stick. So it's a bit different. But these are the only ones I use. So I only use the intuition um, ones just because I feel like they're so much easier to use when you're shaving because you don't have to put like shaving cream or no soap or something because it already comes with a soap around it so it's just easy to just shave and then you don't get cut and stuff like that plus this one is like it has um natural it's all natural ingredients and this one has organic aloe in it so yeah like oh, I'm tripping but yeah so I just wanted to try this one out I think they only just changed like the handle because the other one they still have both types, this and the other one that I use, which is a little bit more thick at the handle. And this one is just thinner and honestly, it was cheaper in Target, so I got it. <laughs> but yeah, that's the only razor that I use. Then I just got me like one of these like sponge washcloths because I mean bath like bath sponges <laughs> because honestly, I have my own washcloth that I use rag to wipe my body. But I was like, I want to use this, you know, because I like. I like some of these so i got one and yellow is my favorite color so i got yellow i actually really like blue blue and yellow are my favorite colors and you know that's really why it's perfect the sorority that i joined because they got my favorite colors to begin with and then don't judge me because this is like store brand but then again when you really think about it i rather buy like um store brand ingredient like store store brand things whether it's food or whatever because if you really compare a store brand to name brands and you look at like ingredients and things that are inside of the things that you're putting on your body or inside of your body if you look at the ingredients i'd rather buy something that has less ingredients than something that has a bunch of ingredients and half of the stuff i don't even know what it is so also why you should shop to your sad brand skin because we only use all natural products like naturally derived products and on top of that i there are stuff that you know exactly what it is like olive oil um not olive oil <laughs> i meant coconut oil you know avocado oil so basically oils honey you know what honey is oatmeal you know what oatmeal is you know stuff that you can pronounce stuff that you know what it is okay so go shop separate skin just throwing that back out there but yeah so i got these um fragrance free cleansing wipes that are ph balanced dermatology tested and gentle on the skin because i have pretty sensitive skin so i can't just use anything anywhere because i will easily like my face i can easily dry out my skin and start breaking out i literally have sensitive skin so i can't just put any and everything on my body so yeah 
but this is for like down there um these are like fragrance free cleansing wipes so like you know if you're out because like spring and summer is coming back around you know so it's gonna get hot depending on whatever you wear outside and if you know hygiene is really important to me like you don't want to be walking around smelling musty you don't want to be walking around stinking any anywhere on your body to be completely honest with you so these definitely come in handy like if you're getting hot you can just wipe down a little bit or whatever so you can keep it clean <laughs> like if you go to the bathroom the little cleanse you know so you're good to go so yeah get you some <laughs> next my video is already long with this little hygiene haul but when i clean my car i'm gonna just show y'all like the inside of it and then i'm probably gonna speed it up and clean my car because i don't really know where i'm gonna even set you up to record the whole thing to begin with but yeah and so then i also got some deodorants these dove deodorants with zero percent aluminum in them and honestly i'm not gonna lie these are actually kind of like I, these are actually deodorant not antiperspirant deodorant um because those are not good for your armpits but deodorant is a little bit whenever i get zero percent aluminum or like natural deodorant and stuff like that honestly it really does break my arms out sometimes not break my arms out but my lymph nodes like I don't know how to explain it. I think they're my lymph nodes. I don't know. They swell up or whatever. And I think it's just that because, like, like I said, I have really sensitive skin. And sometimes they be too strong for me. And the antiperspirant deodorant doesn't cause that. But then I know that antiperspirant deodorant is not good for you. So I try not to use it. And honestly, I try not to use deodorant all the time. <laughs> which sounds nuts. And it's probably like, ew. But I try not to use deodorant all the time because unless like I really have to, like if I'm going out in public, of course I'm going to wear deodorant. But if I'm, at, I'm in my home or whatever, you know, I probably won't wear deodorant. But it's not like I always stink either, you know. I feel like it just depends on you and your your body. <laughs> but when I do wear deodorant, and these ones are 48 hour lasting, so that's bomb because most of them be 24 hour lasting. <laughs> but yeah this one is lavender and vanilla and y'all if you know me you know i love me some vanilla and i love love lavender so i just know this is gonna be bomb and it smells really good and then this one is just like you know a sensitive one for my skin because i also know that you know like i mentioned some deodorants usually actually break me out a lot so i use it whenever i'm actually going out I'm, i'll probably put on some deodorant and sometimes when i take a shower I probably put some deodorant on after but it depends because sometimes when i use it too too much like my skin starts to go crazy because it is a little bit strong but this also does have zero percent alcohol in the both of these so it might be a little bit better than the ones that i was getting before but yeah this is the um for sensitive skin deodorant so yeah i got these two but get you some deodorant because you really don't want to be out here stinking. Like, but then again, I feel like it depends on what you put in your body. Because most people don't have to wear deodorant because they just naturally don't have a smell. But there's a lot of things that you could do to also mask having a smell. And these other stuff, I don't really think they're like, you know, anything. I just got like these like hair clips for my hair. When I do them to like put up my, separate my hair and stuff like that. Because I'm actually about to do my hair and take these braids out because they're looking a bit rusty. It's time for me to get rid of them. <laughs> so, I'm probably, I know I always say that I'm going to do like a hair tutorial. But this time, I'm going to really record it for you guys this time. And then I got me some, um, the Dickinson's Original Witch Hazel. But this is the only brand that I use, Witch Hazel, to wipe my skin down when like, it's oily. Or if I just go outside and come back in, like I wipe my face so, my face down. Because I'm, like, I'm quick to break out, you guys. I'm quick to break out. But I'll use that because if I use any other ones. Well, not any other ones. Because I can use this other one that I don't remember what it's called. But it has like a little red top and it's like a white bottle. That one I can use as well. But there's the one with the blue top. I don't know what it's called. I don't remember the name. But I cannot use that one. I was using it at one point and it was just drying out my skin because my mom had went to the store and bought me some witch hazel. But she picked up that brand. I thought she was picking up this brand. But she picked up that brand and it was just drying out my face. So bad. So bad. <laughs> so I was just like, I can't. I had to stop using it. And I still have a full bottle of it basically. But anyways. And I bought a new bonnet. <laughs> because my other bonnet has a hole in it. Because I used to like put... My bonnet, I don't know, I used to put like, when I have my locks, 
that uh, my faux locks I used to put them in my bonnet and they were like too heavy and too too big for the, that bonnet and so it like ripped a hole in it and everything but yeah and then I bought this um I don't use lotion <laughs> I don't use lotion because like I said I use my body butter just because they're a thicker substance and especially throughout the summer and the winter it lasts more longer it lasts longer on your skin and really like moisturizes your skin a lot more but sometimes if I'm a little bit lazy and I just want to hurry up or put on something quick or whatever I might use some lotion so I saw this Dove um, Body Love Glowing Care lotion it's uh the scent is mango and almond it has mango and almond butters in it and it says it lasts for 24 hours and it's not greasy stuff like that but i decided to um test this out it's for soft glowing skin i was like i'm, I'm gonna test it out even though i don't use lotion that much but like if, you know if I, my hand's a little ashy and i want to put on something real quick i'll probably put on some lotion real quick or whatever or i could keep this in my car you know but like this is what i got this dove lotion it's not even focusing but yeah that's what i got so i'm gonna test it out but yeah i don't took all this stuff out up here and i have to put all of this stuff away Ugh. and now i gotta put all this stuff away so i'm gonna go ahead and do that and then i'll meet y'all outside to go clean my car so but i have never given you guys a car tour so i'm gonna give you a car tour um of my dirty car and then we're gonna clean the inside of it out and vacuum it out and stuff like that but as far as the washing of the outside i'm probably just gonna take it to a car wash because my dad is cementing our driveway right now like a part of our driveway so i can't wash it and then the water rolled down into that so yeah let's go ahead and get started with this little car tour so this is my baby, y'all, that I got after I crashed my other car. So yeah, this is what it's looking like. Look at how dirty that is. The floor, this is embarrassing. Cause I don't know. Like, isn't this cute though? My little steering wheel cover. But this is what the inside of my car is looking like. And then uh, we have, yeah. I need to clean my cup holders. I got a bags over there to take out the trash and throw them in the trash bags. I need to clean out the doors. This is literally the passenger side. This is tragic. And then this is the back seat. Yeah, I need to take out all this stuff. This is the back seat. The floors are a mess. And it's just so much crap in here. And then, ooh, not gonna show y'all my license plate. Then I need to clean out my trunk. Don't ask. I have a shoe i have some makeup back here <laughs> but yeah i'm about to show y'all this is show y'all the front of my car oh my mom is home but this is the front of my car i got my little sigma gamma row sign and yeah i got me a ford echo sport so we're about to go ahead and clean this thing out and i'm gonna set y'all up in a minute and we can ride the book and share that heat of love. I want to ride. Recruiting is 
isn't an option Do you want you? All right, you guys, so I'm back after cleaning my car for a good, it felt like an hour, but I, I don't know how long it was because it took me a long time to like vacuum and stuff. And I feel like so much dust got in my nose. I'm sniffling. But anyways, I finally finished cleaning my car. It's not super, super clean, but it's as clean as I could get it. I'm probably going to go and get it, like, um, detailed because my, my masks. <laughs> but I'm probably going to go get it detailed because my mom, usually whenever, if I go away or sometimes, like, it was, like, a while back. Like, if I would travel and go somewhere or if I just wasn't there for a while or if she needed to use my car because her car wasn't around or whatever i would let her use my car and my mom would pack all her stuff in my car all of it and so i don't know what happened they must have put a milk in my car and i didn't know in the back seat like you know how the back seat has like little pockets yeah there was a milk a protein shake milk type thing in the back of my seat and I didn't even realize it until I was cleaning out my car today because mind you I don't clean out my own car my dad used to clean my car but then he stopped because he's been busy and I don't be cleaning my car because I be too lazy <laughs> and so today I was just like well I need to clean my car so let me go ahead and clean my car because <laughs> it was getting boy out, really out of hand to be honest it was like getting to the point where like it was that like no this ain't it I can't be a girl with a dirty car like this <laughs> And so I cleaned it, but I'm probably going to get it detailed to get it clean, like, really, really, really clean. Because, honestly, when I got it from the dealership, they didn't clean it to begin with, like, how I wanted them to. Um, so I should have been gotten it, like, professionally clean for real. But I'm going to get it detailed. Um, maybe, I don't know when, but whenever I do, I might, rec I don't know when I'm going to do that, honestly. I don't even know if I'm going to record that. But I'm going to do that eventually. Because the milk that spilled in my back of my seat kind of like stained the seat. And I'll show you what it looks like. And that's making me mad. <laughs> so yeah, I just cleaned it. And once I get it detailed, ain't nobody bringing, well, ain't nobody bringing nothing of theirs in here. Like, nobody's leaving anything in here. My mom and my little sister ain't getting in here unless I'm driving. They ain't bringing their stuff in here. <laughs> nobody's leaving anything back in my car. You come in, you take whatever you brought in out with you when you get out that's what it's gonna be but yeah um and there ain't no more eating in here unless i'm eating in here because it's my car but like <laughs> yeah because there's also a stain on my seat as well but i was able to get like scrub that out um oh my car my radio just turned on my radio just turned on but anyways let me go ahead and show you guys my camera is so dusty <laughs> my camera's so dusty from me cleaning my car with the vacuum and all the dust down here but let me go ahead and show y'all what my car is looking like now um, my dad said like the outside is still dirty but that's because i'm gonna take it to get like a car wash so i couldn't get all like the little cracks and crevices but like look at that compared to what it looked like i'll put a before video i mean you're already gonna see the before but i'm gonna put it again so you can see it or it's looking like now my seat i cleaned it the seat out and then i cleaned the dashboard and everything because it was a bit dusty up there but yeah look at this little cute isn't this cute you guys like bling bling i was trying to deck my car out which is why i got like that little this um you know steering wheel cover and then my little phone thing is right here it's all blue you know that's also my favorite color like i mentioned earlier but yeah and then i wiped down my little radio thing but yeah um i got all those from amazon as well if you guys want to figure it find out where i got them from like the little steering wheel cover and stuff like that i can link that in the description below oh i need to show y'all my love push start button but yeah this is the back seat the mat probably needs to be washed but it's okay and then like, i kind of cleaned off the seats and stuff 
and then yeah cleaned over there i'll go over there and show you guys a better view but yeah here goes the back seat clean that but let me show y'all my push start button oh like look at that i even decked that out too like it got the little shiny thingies around it but yeah now let's go over to the other side of the car oh y'all ow i keep hurting myself this the outside it still needs to be washed on the outside of my car but yeah this is the passenger side i cleaned out over here on the floor because if y'all seen it was really dirty wiped everywhere down pretty much i cleaned out the cup holders too because that had stuff in it and then this is the other side back seat like i said i missed like this also that's not something that's the sun <laughs> But like, like I said, I couldn't get every little crack and crevice, but I got most of it. But it's what I'm talking about right here. If y'all can see that, that's where the milk spilled. And this is what it did to the back of my car. And I tried to wipe it out, but I couldn't wipe it out. So I'm going to have to get that like professionally clean and detailed and removed out of my car and stuff like that. But yeah, for the most part, there's that. And then my trunk. Oh, I need to clean the back of my seat. They need to be clean. My trunk just looked like this. I kind of just left the rest of this in here and just threw stuff in that box. I didn't really clean it like that. But yeah. There's that. So. Um, maybe. My little sister and them are outside. So if you hear little kids yelling and stuff. But alright. Anyways. That is what my car is looking like clean for now until i can get it cleaner but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this little productive day with me honestly because i don't ha i feel like the video is already long enough for me showing you guys my target haul plus showing you guys me cleaning up my car the before and after so <laughs> um yeah i'm probably gonna end this vlog off here if you guys want to see more vlogs like this or whatever you guys want to see what kind of vlogs you want to see definitely let me know down below in the description not the description the comment section and i'll definitely record that for you guys but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel because we are on the road to 200 follow not followers 200 subscribers but also don't forget to go shop Sabrian Skin as well and follow us on Instagram at Sabrian Skin in the description below. And also follow my main, my personal Instagram page, Indie Goddess on two underscores. And that's also going to be in the description below. So go follow me because I will follow. I might, mm, I'm not going to, I don't know. But definitely follow me. <laughs> definitely follow me. I greatly appreciate that. But, anyways, um,. Yeah, that's it for this video. You guys stay blessed and you have a blessed week. But yeah, I'm out. <laughs>